Presidential candidate for the Change Ghana political party Robert Badal said for years nothing significant was done by the two major political parties to improve the lives of the people of Linden, a town with major economic prospects. So there was fortunately no, no uh, development at all in that period. And it's a case of, as Nigel will, bring, will, will articulate, it's a case of broken promises. And, and that has been the tale all across rural Guyana, where you come elections time, make promises, and no, none of the promises uh, were being fulfilled. Uh, it's also a tale of, of the implication of race, the role of race in the pol pol politics of Guyana uh, on the, and the economic development, where we make choices on the basis of race. Change Guyana outlined its own development agenda for the region, but in the process secured a public endorsement from young Lindener Ryan Day. Day, who holds a degree in forestry and is a national rugby player, was also critical in his endorsement of how past and current governments have treated the forestry sector and youth in sport. In talking with both Mr. Badal and Mr. Hines, I understand their frustration, not only with the previous government, but the current government. It is our view in the Change Guyana movement that both parties are one and the same. They stand for corruption, backward movement, or regression. Change Guyana plans to address this frustration among Londoners and outline its plan for doing so. The party's prime ministerial candidate, Nigel Hines, said among its plan for Linden and the wider region 10 area is to establish a university campus, an aluminum plant, wood processing factory and furniture factory there. Hines said the party will see that there are incentives for foreign and local investors and a concentrated effort will be made to keep graduates in region 10 by bolstering economic activity. He said there will be major infrastructural development with the Linden to let him highway becoming reality. We must change the extremely underdeveloped state of affairs in Region 10 to one of inclusive and accelerated economic development. And Change Guyana commits to no broken promises and the enrichment of Region 10 by implementing and fulfilling promises made. The party said nothing was wrong with the other party's plans and promises for Linden. It's just that it was never implemented and executed. Hines, too, called out politicians from the two major political parties for consistently failing to keep promises. Kurt Campbell, Newsroom.